President Bola Tinubu has informed the Senate of his intention to present the 2024 Appropriation Bill to a joint session of the National Assembly tomorrow, Wednesday, November 29th by 11 a.m. Tinubu's letter was read by the President of the Senate, Goswil Akpabio, during plenary on Tuesday. In the letter, President Tinubu craved the indulgence of the lawmakers to present the 2024 budget at a joint session of the Senate and House of Representatives. Before appropriation bill, and I crave the indulgence of the Senate to grant me the slot of 1100 hours on Wednesday, the 29th day of November 2023, to formally present the 2024 appropriation bill to a joint session of the National Assembly. While I look forward to addressing the joint session, please accept distinguished. Senate President and distinguished Senators, the assurances of my highest regards. Signed, President Bola Ahmed Tunibu. So tomorrow, Wednesday, we will have a sitting earlier and then we will join Mr. President by 11 a.m. Meanwhile, President Bola Tunibu is asking the Senate to concede and approve the approximately $8.7 billion and $100 million Euro's external borrowing plan to ensure gross implementation of projects. The projects, according to the President, cut across all sectors with specific emphasis on infrastructure, agriculture, education, water supply, employment generation, and security. Quite approval is in the sum of United States dollars. It's Eight billion six hundred and ninety-nine million five hundred and fifty one hundred and sixty-eight thousand then five hundred and fifty-nine uh, dollars, and uh, for the euro, looking at a total of one hundred million euros. Projects and programs in the borrowing plan, including employment generation, skills acquisition support towards the emergence of more entrepreneurs, poverty reduction and food security to improve the livelihood in all the 36 states of the Federation. It has become imperative that we resort to prudent and external borrowing to bridge the financial gap, which will largely be applied to key infrastructure projects, including power, railway, health, among others. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.